So the aim of Phobia's VR is to create a low cost and accessible version of virtual reality that we can use to teach undergraduates how to treat fears and phobias. Previously, I just have paper and I, I draw things on paper or on a blackboard and they're really just shadows, two dimensional shadows of something that really belongs in three dimensions. And I took that idea to the immersive technologies team and they said, that's a great idea, we'll make it happen. And they did make it happen. VR ophthalmology was one of the best student experiences I've had um, at university. It was a very interesting tutorial because we were given headsets that were put on our heads and it was very, very interactive. It was engaging and we were able to see different eye diseases using simulation. And what that does is it does allows the students not just to learn about the diseases but to actually experience what the patient sees literally through their own eyes. Uh, through iteration after iteration of the project to create something that was just amazing, something that runs with hundreds of students sitting in a lab with VR goggles on and they're doing all the things that I want them to do as a lecturer. So working on this VR program with the Immersive Technologies team has been a great experience. Um, it's been incredibly useful for my teaching. And I'm incredibly proud of the lecture that we've actually developed together. It's very, very much regarded by the students. It was really, really exciting, really, really fun and enjoyable and one of the most memorable experiences I've ever had. Uh, I owe them a lot, a lot of thanks because uh, just had their help, um, I was able to create a successful and effective intervention that helped um, reduce people's public speaking anxieties. For me personally uh, as well, being able to look at a room full of students wearing VR goggles and, uh, and being taught mathematics but with a smile on their face, it was a, it was a real eye-opening experience for me.